We've done it, guys. We've done it. The team and I, we're out here in Sumterville. Apparently, we found $225,000 new construction home. Brand new. Within 30 minutes, 35 minutes to Claremont. The 300k in the series continues. Let's go. Yeah. And the 300k. So we are back today. I'm actually in Sumterville. The series continues, as I said in my last video, I'm bringing you the best price points. This home is absolutely beautiful. Right now we are standing in front of a two-story home, just under 1,600 square feet, 1,557 to be exact. What's more important than that is the actual price of this home. I wanna make you guys guess, but I'ma just say it straight out the gate. We are looking at $250,000 for this home standing behind me. It's a three bedroom, three, uh, two and a half bath actually. I'm gonna take you guys inside to come take a look at the actual floor plan and I'll go over all the details after, all right? So I'm gonna take this camera. I got my man Marlon and the team here with me. You know, they always support, support my videos. So let's take a look at this beautiful two story home, all right? First impressions, the moment you walk in, we see we have a covered front patio, front porch area. I actually really do love this. I want you guys to keep in mind, if we are looking at a home that is just under, not even just under, that is under $300,000, keep in mind that the floor plan, the actual build quality to me is very superb. There are little compromises you will have to make, which actually uh, reside on the outside of the home. But as soon as you walk in, we have our initial powder room half bath here i don't know if you guys like when i hold the mic here but it makes me feel like i'm on tv so i like it um this is our initial bathroom right as soon as you walk in i'm just thankful to god that the stairs are actually positioned on this side over here and not right at the front of the door i don't like that i don't know if you guys do but let's be greeted with our great room as we can see the dining will kind of be set here i know i'm running out of daylight i'm sorry guys but i could not wait to show you guys this home such a beautiful layout for an even better price so everything here is standard granite countertops the cabinetry as well the fridge is not included i cannot lie to you guys but at least we do have the semi soft clothes not even semi fully soft clothes uh cabinets right this is where we are this is actually going to be our pantry area i think somebody else is recording with me so this is pretty much what we're being dealt with let's actually go out here and i'll show you guys the rest the spacing between the actual two homes are actually pretty sufficient in my opinion i was a little nervous that they were going to be like you know you stand here and you can kind of reach out your hands and touch both but this is actually pretty sufficient the lot itself is uh i think it was about 0 0.8 acres so that works out to like 3,000 something square feet in total uh you know area it's not the biggest lot but once again to get a two-story home fresh and early uh, another thing that I really wanted to mention to you guys is that this home is actually halfway between the Claremont Ocala side. So if an hour, hour and a half to Ocala is too long for you and you're still looking for those reasonable price points, ton, this neighborhood just might be it for you. So we kind of already went over this. I opened up the pantry. This can kind of be a um, second pantry, right? If you guys have a lot of stuff, this can kind of work out as your second one or maybe a raincoat closet. We do have a two car garage as well, which is actually pretty, pretty nice. I can't lie to you, All right? We're looking at the water heater off to the corner. Sorry for the lighting. Once again, I believe this is a 60 gallon water heater, which I've seen to be rather standard in these new homes. So yeah, now that you guys got a good look at your actual, you know, uh, first floor, kind of entertainment space let's take a look upstairs to see where the actual bedrooms uh reside i do believe the ceilings on the second floor are a little taller than the first floor so that's always a nice touch led cam lighting all throughout my man marlon actually showed me and i'm actually very happy to see that they do have the smoke detectors look him outside over there hey he saw us <laughs> okay so this is a loft but um this can definitely still be at least a seating area i see that they have it wired up for a tv so maybe you put a nice couch here and this kind of be a semi-loft entertainment space you can treat it as such 
um, I am happy to see that they do have the upgraded Honeywell home system. Now we have options here. This floor plan probably isn't going to be too unfamiliar with you guys as all the bedrooms are kind of nestled off to the corner. But for three bedrooms and two and a half baths, it's not bad. This is our initial bedroom that we're going to visit. So two more after this. This has a semi walk-in closet, which is actually pretty nice touch especially if you guys have a family look at them out there <laughs> um like i said especially if you guys have a family i'm kind of more oriented to uh present things that fit your uh, my viewers kind of needs i noticed that a lot of you guys that have been calling me you know are family men uh you guys have you know kids and things as such so i'm kind of just uh trying to pivot and show you guys floor plans that would not only work for you uh, price-wise, but for your family, you know? I want you guys to be comfortable. I don't feel that there should be such a big compromise when it comes to being made and purchasing either your first home or, or your, your second or third home. But for the price, it just makes sense. Granite countertop, of course. This is our second, sorry for breathing the mic, but this is our second full bath. Right now, if you visit right here, at least we have a nice little linen closet. It's not the biggest, but once again, this is not even $300,000, not even two seventy. dollars This is like two fifty-seven, dollars I believe. Remember, they have these homes actually available. We're in Sumterville. Now, let's see our grand master suite. This room is actually bigger than I anticipated for it to be. I do like that it's kind of nestled off in the actual back corner of the house. So you can kind of get a good overview of the actual backyard. Um, it's not bad at all, I can't lie. Vinyl plank flooring, of course, as we saw downstairs, dual sinks. This is actually rather sufficient for all the homes that I've been through. This is, you know, one of my top picks when it comes to making a smart decision, not only financially, but keep in mind, I know you've got seen a repeated theme when it comes to homes at these price points, right? If this is a new developing area and you're trying to get in early, trust me, when you see homes at this price, it doesn't mean that the builders, you know, are poor quality. It just means that the area is developing as a whole. So the earlier you get in, the better you're, better off you and your family is going to be later than the line. So that's just, you know, even besides this home, I feel like uh, laundry room, of course, I feel like this is or this what I just stated was a, a good piece of information for everybody to kind of listen. Right. Trust me, guys, I'm thinking about building generational wealth. You know, this home might be, you know, just for you to lay your head out. But trust me, you make a good decision on buying a home in the right area at the right time. You can literally change your family's life forever. You know, so I'm kind of thinking of things in that sense. Uh, like I said, my name is Brandon Polito. I don't think I mentioned that this time. I usually never forget to, but I'm sure you guys know by now. <laughs> My name is Brandon Polito. I'm a realtor over here, part of the Prasad Group. I absolutely have an amazing time making these videos. Once again, I'm gonna put the number here. So if this model or any of the other ones that are gonna be following after this uh, video interests you, make sure you reach out to myself in the group. We're gonna get you more than situated as we always do. Remember, the next video after this is gonna be the actual bigger floor plan. Still, I believe under 280, 270. So we're not even touching the $300,000 mark at all with these next three videos I'm doing. And there is another single story. So keep that in mind. The team and I are out, 225. I really uh, appreciate, you, uh, appreciate you guys more than you realize. Hope you love the content. Hopefully it's getting better and I'm gone. This is it, Let's this go. is it, this is it. We've done it guys, we've done it. The team and I, we're out here in Sumterville. Apparently we found $225,000 new construction home. Brand new. Within 30 minutes, 35 minutes to Claremont. Under 300K, the series continues. Let's go. Yeah. Under 300K.